cubroot by factor method. Now this method involves expressing the number of interest as a product of its prime factors in index or power form. The powers should be divisible by 3. Very important. Now, for example, we want to use factor method to find the cube root of 1728. So in our solution, uh, 1728 expressed as a product of its prime factors would be 2 power 6 times 3 power 3. So it plus to note that the power uh, uh, of 2 is 6, which is divisible by 3, and the power of 3 is 3, which is also divisible by 3. And therefore, we can use factor method as follows. So in this case, we divide each power by 3. The result will be two power two times three power one, and that's twelve. Let us look. Uh, now look at cube roots from mathematical tables. It's important to know that there is no cube root tables provided. Now we use the table of cubes to find cube roots. For example, we look at uh, example 6. We want to find the cube root of 3519. So our solution is we express 3519 in standard form. That would be 3.519 times 10 power 3. Therefore, cube root of 3519 would be cube root of 3.519 times cube root of 10 power 3. In the row indicated 1.5 and column 2, we find a number which is closer to 3.519 and that number is 3.512 the difference of 7 is looked up within the same row but the last column and it is found in column 1 it's so important to note here that the difference is uh, the difference between 3.519 and 3.512 is 7. So this is what we look up for in the last row. Now that is found in column 1. And therefore, we can conclude that the cube root of 3519 is 1.521 times 10 per 1 and that gives us 5.5 5.5 
15.21 to four significant figures.